and what up? That's how 1822. So, Impact Wrestling sets a new record on Pop TV. What does this mean? I'm going to tell y'all what it means. You know, for the longest in the wrestling community, you have these wrestling fans telling other wrestling fans, and these wrestling fans feed into that crap. And that's why you see wrestling fans today as marky ass wrestling fans. Because they've been telling you that wrestling is no longer about characters. It's about the athletes. It's about the end brain workers. It's about who a great worker. So today decided, you know what? Let's do something over the top. Jeff Hardy, Matt Hardy, two characters telling a funny story. The final deletion. What did the final deletion do for TNA? Got TNA a lot of buzz. Was it a wrestling match? Straight up, one of the wrestling match like you see Monday Night Raw every single Monday with bland characters? No, it was two characters doing over-the-top stuff. And it drew interest from wrestling fans to tune in to Pop TV. And it was a success for TNA. So, when you look at a company like WWE with so many bland characters like a cab driver like Sami Zayn, and they have one-on-one -on -one wrestling matches, that's it. No characters really. No huge personalities. And this is the company that's supposed to be entertainment, but 10 the one been entertainment. WWE is catering to these marks who only care about end ring wrestling, nothing else. They don't care about vice skill. They don't care about personality. They don't care about storytelling. Just being great in the ring. They tell you the business has changed. It sure did change. People watch less. You're right. That's why the business has changed. Because when you see wrestling today, it's so boring. And for some reason, these fans love the crap that the company gives them today. It's so bad. But they love it. It's the best thing ever. You hear them say, Dad of Era never had the best ever wrestling like today. The Adams era was the most successful era in professional wrestling history. Today, in the WWE, they can't even draw the ratings they did back in the 90s. Yeah, the wrestling is so much better today, and people still watching less. I mean, these fans are just idiots. Just because the wrestling today is better than the Adams era, it doesn't mean shit because fans are not tuned in to watch. TNA proved it today. And the business... Character still sells. Matt Hardy and Jeff Hardy proved it. They sold people on an over the top storyline and they work for TNA. So, for the fans who keep telling fans it's all about the end ring wrestling, well, how come TNA didn't draw a rating like they did for the final issue with a regular straight up wrestling match with bland characters and not really a storyline? No, I can give you the answer. Tenny did sell the characters to get a good rate for them. The biggest they got on Pop TV. Now, of course, it's not a two or three, but for Pop TV standards, that's still pretty good because it's not every home like the USA Network. So I want to thank Tenny for what they did on the two for the final issue. I really enjoyed it, and I've watched Tenny ever since. I wish W start doing stuff like this. Go back to like that used to be with over the top characters, larger life personality, and not these bland ass characters you see every Monday or Monday Night Raw. Is these people who don't like characters? Hell, who gives a damn about those fans? Let them watch R Wave and Dragon Gate. Let the fans who like personality watch Monday Night Raw. That's what W needs to get back to large life characters. Over the top storylines. I want to see that from the WWE because you are not getting it from World Wrestling Entertainment. You call yourself entertainment, where is entertainment at? Because I don't see it. The entertainment I was watching was on Tuesday nights, Impact Wrestling, The Final Alicia. That was entertainment. Thank you, TNA, because I'm tired of seeing this crap we get from the WWE every single time. So, that's it for the video. Don't forget. Hit the subscribe button. I am out. Peace.